Hello everyone, today we are going to take a look at another plugin called Goyo, which is currently in a beta status and allows you to split voice, room tone and reverb into three separate channels which you can use individually, but also allows you to clean your voice and get rid of any ambient noise and reverb. And it's free while it's in the beta version. It will probably become paid as soon as it's a full release, but right now you can download it for free and test it out on your own. So let's get ready to try it out now. Here we are in front of a little test recording that I did in my unprocessed recording environment. It's one of the typical voice recordings that I do for every plugin that I want to put on my vocals, right? So here is a test. This is a little test recording for testing the Goyo app, which is currently available as a beta and allows us to strip away reverb, boom noise, and split our voice into separate three channels so that you can either use any one of those three. So this is a rather long recording. We probably don't need to use all of that, but he, that is the clean recording and it's absolutely not clean. You can hear my room noise. You can hear a bit of reverb and we will now put Goyo on this. So press F on that. One voice, one item. And then we type the name, which is Goyo written G-O-Y-O. G-O-Y-O. Add effects to track one voice dialogue filter. List one list. VST. Goyo. Super tone. One of two. VST three. Goyo. Super tone. Two of two. Let's pick that. Effects. And right away, we can go into the plugin window with F6. Unknown. And we cannot see anything here, which is good to know. It's not accessible in the traditional way that you can use the plugin. It's kind of readable with OCR, but we don't need to use this. We can just go directly into the parameters window by pressing escape and getting out of this. Unsaved. And now press P. FX parameters dialog 0.0, .0 parameter. Combo box ambience gain 0, collapse alt plus P. Now let's just go through all those settings here. We've got ambience gain. Ambience solo 1. Ambience solo. Ambience mute 2. Mute. Voice gain 3. Voice gain, solo and mute. Voice solo, four. Voice mute, five. And we've got. Voice reverb gain, six. Voice reverb gain. Voice reverb solo, seven. Solo. Voice reverb mute, eight. Mute. So those are the three bands that the plugin has. Let's see all the other options that it has to offer. Mono or stereo, nine. Mono or stereo. There's a little typo in here. Bypass, ten. And bypass, and that's all there is to say about this. So mono and stereo allows you to say, yeah, I want to process this in stereo instead of mono. If you do that, then the plugin will take up much more RAM and CPU power to process your stuff. But if you're actually working with the stereo signal, then feel free to enable it. If you're working with mono only, then stay with mono mode. It would be much more efficient on your CPU power. So what is the plugin all about? Well, you can decide that you only want to solo your voice or you want to only solo the ambience or the reverb or probably the better use is to get rid of those. How would you do that? Well, if you just want to get rid of, let's say, the ambience, then you just tick the mute box here, right? Let's see him. Ambience solo one. No. Nope. Ambience mute two. Right. Now let's flip that on. Value. Slider off. On. Great. Unset. Let's now hear. This is a little test recording for testing the Goyo app which is currently available as a beta and allows us to strip away reverb, boom noise, and split our voice into separate three channels so that you can either use any one of those three. And this is pretty awesome, right? The entire room noise is gone. We can also flip that into solo and just listen to the room noise. Epic. Ambient, ambient, mute, too. Now toggle this off again, value. Off. and now flip this to solo. Ambient solo value. Great. On. On. Let's see my room noise only. Now. 
Now, obviously, you've got some artifacts like voice reminders and everything in there. It's not going to be really clean, but it is useful. Now, I don't need my soloed ambience um, in any situation, but if I wanted to have it, I would just go there and just record it. But you get the idea. So the probably most useful use case would be to solo your voice only and also get rid of the reverb. Let's just enable that. Let's go here, disable the solo again, and go to the voice. Great, enable that. And here we go. This is a little test recording for testing the Goyo app, which is currently available as a beta and allows us to strip away reverb, room noise, and split our voice into separate three channels so that you can either use any one of those three. Now, let's check the parameters again. We have gain, which is by default for all three bands, set to zero. So you can increase or change the gain. Instead of muting or soloing any band, we can just lower the volume of those bands individually, if that is what we want to do. As you might have noticed, the reverb reduction is not as efficient as with other packets. I turned this on, but instead of removing the reverb, it's probably just reducing it quite a bit, but it's not getting rid of it entirely. It's not like it's it's really doing much to my reverb in this room, as, at least not, uh, which, is, which is fine. The reverb that is still in there can be usable, and it's there are YouTube videos where more reverb is, is actually going on. So this is acceptable. But where this plugin really shines for now is the ambient removal. And this is pretty neat. I'm actually planning to replace some of my background noise removal tools like isotopes, noise removal stuff with this plugin because it's much more CPU efficient. It's much more low latency, so it will process incoming signals much faster. It's AI driven, it's powerful, and it does the same job that my isotope refurb combination usually does. So I'm planning to do this in the future to speed up rendering processes and everything. And the only thing that it cannot do that well right now is the room and reverb removal. It also doesn't have any parameters to control what it does. It's just applying some learned AI algorithms to your signal and the final result speaks for itself. But yeah, so that's Goyo. It's really simple to use. It is currently free. It's also still in development, so it's going to get updates and maybe the reverb removal will improve in the future. But right now it is really useful for it can get rid of your ambient noise if you so happen to have and ambient noise on your recordings. So go ahead and give it a try. It's really simple and straightforward and free. Go ahead to the website linked in the video description. Check it out for yourself. Thanks for watching this video. If you're interested in more content like this or in music content, I'm currently doing the June theme of the day challenge where I upload one short video every day, taking on the challenge to compose a little piece for a different topic changes for every day of the month of June. So if you're interested in that, then feel free to check out the playlist that you can find in the info card or the video description and be right back for next Monday when I will upload my next video. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye bye.